This is Tyler with Range Crew Cowboys, and I'm just going to be showing off some of the bits and head stalls that we use. This is a bozel. This just goes completely off of nose pressure. Just this, my hand's the horse's nose. When you turn the reins, it put pressure on their noses. Horses skin have a lot more nerves than humans, so they can feel pressure a lot easier. This is a <clears throat> a band single ear that's split so you'd put this over the head I'll do these fingers as the ears sorry and then have that ear go through there this will just help hold it on sorry got this all tangled up one sec I don't like these reins sometimes Alright, this is the reins, it's just pretty simple, single rein, and then this is something that you can just tie on or just lead them with, <clears throat> just so you don't have, so you can get further away from your horse. And this also has a shoe fly, this just goes under their chin, just to help keep flies off their face. Then, this is a hackmore. Hackamore, just depending on how you want to say it. This also goes off the nose pressure like the Bozel. This one's just a more southern style, like... Sorry, that little piece is annoying me. Then this goes there. This goes... Their nose goes through here. This one is a... I don't remember what this part's called. How this configuration's called, but... This goes around the brow. Like over their eyes. This is called a brow band. And both of these just sit over top of the ears back here then. These reins are just single, they're waxed. One horse loves to eat them. <laughs> and then, uh, <clears throat> this is just a single ear with a, I don't remember what this exact bit is called, but it has three brakes in it. I believe this is sweet iron. I don't remember though, but yeah, beautiful beadwork on it. And then this single ear, this part just slides over their ear. I don't like using these when I'm out doing cowboy stuff just because if your horse brushes up against a tree, it could get pulled right off their head. And then, well, that's just a whole nother set of problems. And then, uh, this one's a bit more of a severe bit. It's really heavy. It's really pretty, though. This part has some hair. And then, yeah, here. This bit is really movable. These copper pieces can roll. There's a brake right here that lets this, and that also rolls. <clears throat> this is an older head stall. My dad's had it for a while. It's really easy to change out. You just slide this part up through here. Then on the back, there's that little ring, and then just pull the bit off. Get that back in there. This one hasn't been used recently, so it doesn't have any reins on it. And then, <clears throat> this is the one that I've been using since Christmas. This was a gift to me. It's really pretty. Studded all along the brow band. I have what's called a Tom's Thumb bit. Just has one single break right here. The shank is decently long. Sorry, forgot English. And then, these are just some single reins, my split reins, and winter sometimes drag in the deeper snow, and that can just ruin them. But yeah, that's all the bits that we use, and uh, Ashton just uses whatever one that he rides on. All right, thanks for watching. Bye.